So it says to factor that thing. And so uh, remember, factoring means you get the sum, you're going to express it as a product. So I'm going to start with a generic rectangle. The 2x squared is up here, 15 is here. And then my question becomes, um, what goes here and here? And I'm going to use this information to get there. The product has to be the same as that product, 30x squared. Notice the product comes from there. And the sum we're going to add to is just that middle term. So now I have to think about uh, what are two numbers that add 30? Nope. What are two numbers that multiply to 30 but add to 13? And if I think about those factors of 30, 1 and 30, no. 2 and 15, no. 3 and 10. So I know that one of these is 3x, one of these is 10x. It doesn't matter which one I place where. And now I go to factor it. You're not done yet. Remember, there's still work to do. If I look across this one, uh, what goes into both of those? 2 and an x. Look across here. These are both divisible by 3. If I look down this way, an x. If I look down this way, a 5. And I can check it. That multiplies to 15, 10x, and so on. So I'm there. I'm almost factored. This side is x plus 5. This side, 2x plus 3. Oh, I'm so good.